evening dear, I'm Talent Rose and welcome to Lucy. Um, another um, RPG Maker horror game I found on Steam for about two pounds. Was it two pounds? I think it was two pounds. And it's about a little girl. Her name is Lucy, as you see. And she wakes up in a strange room. And there she encounters various horrors. Typical RPG horror maker game thingy. I'm curious what else it might bring, so let's start a new game. This game contains content that may not be suitable for sensitive people. But it looks like it. Should I tell you about keys? Yeah, sure, I'm gonna forget about it anyways. Okay. Can can be out All right. Good luck. Uh, thank you. Where do I save? Hello. Oh, I know this music. <laughs> it's default. Oh, I'm already playing. Game instructions. All right. All right. All right. Where do I save? That's the most important bed. Bed. Uh, uh, thing. Lock cabinet. Upon close inspection, you notice that the last drawer of the cabinet seems unlocked. Open it. Yes, a room key. Mouth wardrobe. Hello, do I save with you? A creepy door with a black dress. I'm sorry, what? There's some petitionary erased writings on it with the date on them. September 15th. So, what about it? I save. Not wardrobe. Not wardrobe. A broken clock. Bitch. Hey, 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 I saw you. Oh, now she's gone, is she? Oh, fucking great. How do I save? Okay, wants attention. Um. Um, how do I save? Classic three in a uh, great. How the fuck do you even go in here? Looks like a cross trying to say something. Yeah, sure. Ah! Oh! Thank you. I don't really get how you are in here, but okay. A dreamer's diary. Read it? Yes. I watched myself sleep again last night. It's called lucid dreaming. This time I walked as far as I ever did from my body. Did you? That's a candlestick. Okay. Oh, this is great. Ew. What the fuck? Painting of a young lady. Wow. The sign is illegible. Fuck. And the room? No. Fuck no. Doors locked. Yeah, let's go to the blood stains. But maybe go in there anyway. Hello. Oh shit. Oh no. That's not good. That doesn't look tasty at all. Do you must know? It's read it. Although he's not intelligent, he does not like to be stolen from. Nobody fucking likes to be stolen from. I'm not gonna take any of your shit. Doesn't even look tasty, mate. Mm. Let's go where the blood is. Warehouse. Enter the room, yes. Hello, oh shit. The crows call me observing the warehouse. Shut up. Carry wood last land. Empty shelf. That's great so far. It's just um RPG Maker Horror Game 101. So what about you, huh? I am starving. Please help me. Find something to eat. You just found something crawling from inside the box. Fuck no. 
There's a lock with the four digit passcode on the board. Fuck's sake. I don't have one. Nothing happened. Of course not, because I don't have anything. <sighs> Maybe a poor decision. Open it anyway. I'm gonna die here. <coughs> Fucking knew it. <laughs> September 15? Nothing happened. Not it. That's not it. I need a. F uh. Yes, cat. I know it's terrible. Hey, do you have a four-digit code? I guess not. <laughs> what? <laughs> what is it? What do you want? Unless why was so forsaken like this. Please help me. Find me something to eat. Do you have a four digit code? Then I'm gonna get you something to eat. I know what I have to do. Fuck's sake. I can't run, right? I fucking hate this. It's so obvious. It's so bloody obvious. You want fish? gonna kill me. The sound of a gate opening it goes from the room. Oh, that's too bad. Ah fucking finally that's there was a pain in the ass. The lock was opened. Closed box open it. What the fuck fake fruits? Fucking Alright. Alright I, I see you I see what yeah I see what you get. As, yeah, cat, I see what you're getting at. Go out the f Love, what the fuck is wrong? I know what's wrong. You're not getting any other food. You're gonna eat what's on your plate. Here. Ah. Yes. There we go. No, you have nothing to whine about it. Fuck off. I got a fake apple. Shut up. Here. Alas, fuck off. Here, take the fucking apple. What is this? You actually bought me an apple. Huh. <laughs> I'm a skeleton city girl. Do you really think I need to eat? Too bad he didn't realize you stole from him. Would have been f way funnier. He did realize pl plenty of times that I stole from him. The fuck was that? I saw eyes. What the hell is going on? I'm sorry. You hear footsteps on broken glass passing through you. Passing through you? Of course. Why not pass through me? Get out! I'm trying to. I'm trying. What now? You had an unlocking sound in this hall. Fuck's sake, then the other door was unlocked. There we go, hello. Faceless lady. Wait a second, I'm gonna follow you in a second. A dreamer's diary. I used to spend hours exploring surreal scenarios and meeting beings that could not only could only exist in dreams. But what once was something that amazed me quickly turned out to be my biggest nightmare. Too bad. Lady Lady, you need to stop being faceless, alright? The cross gazing at you upon the pillar. Fuck no. I'm not one to be afraid of dolls. But I know what- Oh my fucking candle lit in the dark. Wow. <laughs> that was ugly. 
and what do they say? I know what dolls and bears do in these kind of games. Fuck's sake, you look like the doll in the main menu. Why? Why? <sighs> do not believe their lies. I'm not. Don't worry. I won't. Well, that's 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 not very nice, is it? <sighs> that wasn't very nice. I'm not that ugly. All right, tell me, tell me your stories. Those are whispering to each other. Well, what are they whispering? Then fuck you. Fuck's sake. Got my heart beating good. Alright. So, now what? Oh. Book called The Girl Who Cried Wolf. Isn't it a boy? I don't care. It's 2019. Who are you assuming fucking genders? Fuck's sake, the world is going to an end. Read it, yes. There was a shepherd who once had to travel outside his village to take medicine for his deceased mother. To take medicine for his deceased... Alright. Why not give the deceased medicine? I mean, it couldn't get any worse. So he left his daughter, who was always wore a red ribbon and a red dress, watching the village village cheap. He told her that if a wolf appeared, happened to appear, I'm sorry, yeah, she should scream "wolf," and the villagers would help her. To amuse herself during the, her boring watch, she took a great breath and sang out "wolf, wolf, wolf," is chasing the cheap. The villagers came running up to the hill to help the girl drive the wolf away. But when they arrived at the top of the hill, they found no wolf. The girl laughed at the sign of their angry faces. Later she saw a real pack of wolf prowling about her flock. Alarmed, she, uh, she leaped for her to her feet and sang out as loudly as she could, Wolf! Wolf! But the villagers thought she was trying to fool them again, so they didn't come. The wolves ate the flock and the girl. She never lied again. Well, considering she was dead, isn't the original story about the boy who yelled thrice wolf? Isn't that... He's yelling thrice? It's of a candlestick. I'm seeing a piano, but whatever suits your tastes, I guess. Book called a double, double ganger study. The term refers to a wraith that cast no shadows and is capable of changing its appearance to mimic a living person, so a shapeshifter. They also may attempt to plant sinister ideas in a victim's mind or cause them great confusion. Wow. As, as great as the confusion was, as I saw the fucking grey wendigo going up the stairs just as a few seconds ago. The portraits. Um, there was a hunter in the woods who, after a long day hunting, was in the middle of an in immense forest. It was getting dark and having lost his Bearings, he decided to head in one direction until he, well, he was clear of the increasingly oppressive foliage. After what seemed like hours, he came across a cabin in a small clearing. Realizing how dark it had grown, he decided to see if he could stay there for the night. He approached and found the door ajar. Nobody was inside. The hunter flopped down on a single bed, deciding to explain himself to the owner in the morning. As he looked around the inside of the cabin, he was surprised to see the walls adorned by several portraits, all painted in incredible detail. With an exception, they appeared to be staring down at him, their features twisted into looks of hatred and malice. Staring back, he grew increasingly uncomfortable. Making a concerted effort to ignore the many hateful faces, he turned to face the wall and, exhausted, he fell into a restless sleep. The next morning, the hunter woke. He turned, blinking in unexpected sunlight. Looking up, he discovered that the cabin had no portraits, only windows. Oh no. Hey bear. It was a matter of time until they would get him. Oh, do you want to press through? The door's got the key. Maybe they will handle you if, it, if you ask nicely. Hand it to you, I mean. Uh, beware of them, or you end up like him. Table turned open. Oh, I see. I see how it is. I see how it is. Thank you. 
adults, I need your key. All adults but me are lying. The key is inside the last drawer of the cabinet in this room. Go ahead and check it. Open this door. Fuck no. The black doll lies. The key is in possession of the brown or red doll. Open this door. No, stop opening dolls. Only two dolls are lying. Open this door. Stop opening dolls, Lucy. The answer you're looking for is the blue doll. Gonna die anyway. The answer is the brown or the black doll. Alright, I see... I see that you need to make some renovations in here. I see a brown doll and I see a green doll, but I don't see a black doll. Open it. And... Um, that. Well, that's too bad. Ikea killed me. Are oh, the dolls are by me are lying? Yes. You get closer upon the dolls. You get closer to open the dolls' torso. And died. <coughs> Too bad. I'm just doing some try and error here. <laughs> Alright, bitch, you're lying to me, aren't you? You get closer. And died. Oh, oh, shit. Ah, oh, thank you. Oh god. Loud noises echoes from the doll's room. What's going on here? No breakfast, that's for sure. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Alright. I'm gonna go. Go. Oh no, oh no. What the fuck was that? Does a brush open the table? A brush open up in the table. Pick it up, of course. A princess paintbrush. Oh, great. There are some colored objects upon it, but you can't reach them. I noticed that. What the fuck was that? The f no, face lady saved me. Go bow with the yellowish brown paint. Cut Color the paintbrush with paint. Yes. The paintbrush now has color. Colored. Fling! Paint what you want to use. Yeah, okay. With no color. With no color. Can I move that? Nope. Okay. Nothing happened. Of course not because I didn't color the fucking door. I need to color the door. Yeah, I want to say you need to color the entire door for it to work. Push it! Nothing happened. Why the fuck did nothing happen? Something happened. Hello, no, it's gonna kill me. Oh no. Alright, you need to do something for me, alright? Your but I don't have the right colour for it. Oh fuck's sake. Colour the brain. No, it's color. What was it again? Red paint. Alright, red like blood. It's gonna kill me. It's gonna kill me. With a container. Because it's colored. Oh, you're gonna kill me. Could you do this? Thank you. Very nice of you. The crow looks grumpy. What the fuck are you grumpy? What the fuck did I do to you, huh? What 
What do you want? Uh, do nothing. Yeah, come on. Suicide booth. Yeah. Seems about right. <coughs> oh, that's too bad. <laughs> Follow me, my minion. Let's color this. I see a black door and I want to paint it red. That way around, isn't it? Anyway, you get why I'm trying to sing here. <clears throat> Move it. Why are you grumpy, huh? Follow me. Tell the armor to break it. Did you broke it? Yes. Thank you. Call it. Fling. Call it. A fling. 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 It's purple though. Push it. Something wrong happened. Something wrong. Why did something wrong happen? What do you mean something wrong happened? Oh. Fuck. Hello. A canvas facing the skeleton. Flip it around. Yes. That's lovely. Of coloring paint. That's great. So what about it? It's great. Did you paint that? A dreamer's diary. This one time I found myself surrounded by them. I was helpless. But then this girl appeared. This faceless girl? She helped me too. Hello. Skeleton with no limbs in a prince attire. Cool. That wasn't nice. Armor. Knight. Follow me. Next time I go into a room, you have to follow me there, right? I'm scared without you. Ah, something wrong happened, you say. Love. Alright, you know what? Stay still. Thank you. I need some red paint. I don't need water to clean my brush f afterwards, don't worry about it. The door's locked. Yeah, of course the door's fucking locked. Something wrong happened. Ah, oh, fuck. Why are you there now? Do you want me to do that? Suicide booth. It's not gonna help me. See? I don't have the right color for it. Follow me. Not follow me. I need your help. You have to do something with that. Break it, please. <coughs> oh, thank you. What color do I have again? I forgot. Ah, yes, yes, yes. That makes sense. So the blue lever for the red door and the red lever for the purple door, of course. Love, why are you grumpy? Love, you're awfully slow down there, right? The door's locked. Why is the door locked? Because I didn't fucking 
Activate the lever, did I? I wish I could run in this game. I really wish I could run. Did I? Something wrong happened. Yeah, something wrong. Hmm. Oh. All right. Oh, the sound of geese running through the room. What did I do? Follow me. Now I said follow me. Are you not going anywhere else? Tell the armor to push the shelf, please. Oh shit. I said push it. Key was dropped from the shelf. Pick it up. Small key. Thank you. What exactly did that do? I don't know. It did something. It was locked. I have a key, but whatever. So now I have a key and I made some gears running. You're okay again, I guess. What did I do? Stay still, I need to do something here. The lever did a clicking sound. Oh, that's great. I should go safe. Yeah, you look grumpy, shut up. Nobody cares. <laughs> Alright, now this door's locked. Why is the door locked? Hear the unlocking sound in this hall. Get closer to the open door. Something is strongly pounding the door from the other side. Choose ex action. Take a peek through the window, please. Because it's so dark, you can't see a thing. Do nothing. Follow me. You go there. Yes. Send the armor to check it first, please. <laughs> I mean... What's gonna do? Your footsteps of the armor going away. Did the armor fucking betray me? You're still my armor. <coughs> Shut up. Hello. You're so dark you can't see a thing. Should open the door. Hello. What happened? The door lost its color, fuck's sake. What's that? Oh no, my armor! I lay down this armor for you. Let's no, harm, there's blood all over the hall, suggesting that a conflict had place here. Oh, my armor. Oh god, no. Little Faber book. I already read it, didn't I? Yes, I already read it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. She never lied again because she fucking died. Use the library's key to unlock the door. Hello. Book's called the statue. 
One night, a mother and father decided they needed a break, so they wanted to head out for town. Great. They called their most trusted babysitter. When the babysitter arrived, the two children was already fast asleep in bed. Later that night, the babysitter got bored and went to watch TV. Oh, I'm sorry, I thought it's an old story with evil and shit. Okay. But you couldn't watch it downstairs because they did not have cable downstairs. Uh, sure. So she called them and asked if she could watch cable in the parents' room, which the parents, which the parents agreed to. But the babysitter had one final request. She asked if she could cover up the angel statue outside the bedroom window with, with a blanket, blanket or cloth because it made her nervous. The phone line was silent for a moment. The father, who was talking to the babysitter at the time, the time said, Take the children and get out, the ha out of the house. We are call the police. We don't own an angel statue. The police found both the children and her babysitter stumped in the pools of their own blood within some mini minutes of the call. No statue was found. That's ominous and dark. Make haste. Oh, great, no, thank you. You fuck. Hello? You didn't see me, right? No, he didn't see me. Shit. The crook looks, uh, crow looks annoyed by something. I am annoyed too. I guess. Hello. Sorry. <laughs> Not going there. Oh god. Keep an eye on the angel. What fucking angel? Are we talking weeping angels here? I don't need, I don't want that shit. Man, I love that shit. Nothing happened. Oh fuck. The dusty white sofa. A fireplace. The dusty white sofa. Hello. Nope. <laughs> nope. Nope. We're talking weeping angels here. Nope. All right, let's go to the poison room then. Da -da -da -da. A shovel. The uh, Read it. No. Fuck no. I don't have time. Who do you think you are? Tell me. Not annoyed by something. Yes, I am annoyed too. Um, I should follow that maid. I have a shovel. Or not. Oh, fuck's sake. A dead lamp. What again? Keep an eye on the angel. I'm gonna keep an eye on the angel. Hello. And she said you're holding a purple flower. Pick up the flower. Yes, it's my flower now. Here. Give the flower. It's the only... It's gonna kill me. Oh, it's not. Oh, it's gonna kill me. Oh. Hear sound of something crawling in the grass. Yeah, you got something to say? I thought so. I thought so. Ah. <laughs> ah. Ah, no. Yeah. That's great. Now I got a sh thing there. Alright, the angel disappeared, but there's a tent. I don't know what? I don't know what? I'm sorry, I didn't quite catch that. The girl proceeded to protect me every night while I was searched for my room. They seem to fear her. They try to avoid us when I am with her. Yeah, but what did they, what did they say? I don't know something. Use the shovel to... Uh, yes. What the fuck? Thank you.
No, oh. Sorry. Yes. Now what? Now what happens? Nothing happened. Of course nothing happened. I am annoyed too. Uh, was our a Prussian prince? A contestant of the chamber? Violet, yellow, orange, white, violet. <coughs> violet, yellow, orange, white, yellow. That's not that's not that's not so bad because I I think I remember my last dad. I had an unlocking sun in this room and the fucking spider. I'm sorry, what? <coughs> That's not very nice now, is it? That wasn't very nice now, was it? Ah. How about you? Oh. Are you fucking? Mm. No, I don't like games where I can't run. Give me the opportunity to run, or at least go here, because you can fit through there. Don't fucking. I can't run, and I hate that. It's unnecessarily stressful. Now she's having a sing again. Go. Hello. This is great. This is great. Hello. To cross dock and start with the spider's web. Oh no, baby. <gasps> Can't I help it? Try fire. <laughs> sure, try fire, but can I help the fucking crow? It's, it's saving me. Poor crow. <laughs> 